Hello everyone, welcome back to Super Mario Land 3, Tangler's Return, Mario Rom Hack. Uh, this is part 3, World 3, welcome to the jungle. Uh, in this part, we will... Oh, okay. oh. oh, I can't climb my name, okay. Okay, so we're introduced to dinos here, and rhino things. And really good music. I like these plants, it's really nice. They um, remind me of the uh, lavender plants, the um, purple ones that we get. So that's really nice touch there, little exotic array. Anyway, let's just continue on with this uh, one pack, shall we? Um, still working. Really? You really did it to me, little shit? Yeah, I'm still working the um, 30 hour shift. I've only got two days left to go on it. So, that is quite good in itself. Uh, and decent. This, we came hoping to go to a meet and a. Um, Carnival. Um, I will be filming at both places, but to be honest, I've already think I've already told everyone about this. So, well, mm. so yeah. Um, I will get it filmed, get it edited, get it. Mm. Shit. Okay, let's do that. Let's kill you. Okay. Like this is this just coins and stuff? But it's, yeah, it's gonna be a dragon coin, yeah. Or a um dragon mushroom. Well, this is a kind of a dangerous situation to be in. There you go. Okay, that's good. Yeah, a lot of the level design in this one is really, really good, really decent. Yeah, red, red exit. Short, uh, see. Pe Perlis plant life. That's gonna be one of these levels. Yep. This one of these levels. Oh. Wait, so. Can't climb up these. Okay. Check the pipes. Always check the pipes. Check the pits as well. So you never know. Okay. Okay. Oh, that is nothing in there. Right, nothing in there, okay. Nothing in there. So yeah, it's basically checking um, pits and pipes and stuff. I very much doubt it's in there. Because there's nothing about it. Actually, is there? Um, No, I thought there would be. I thought there would be a block of sorts in there, but it's not. Oh, there's something down here. What is in this direction? Two, two vines. Let's go up one. And there's one that leads out, so let's actually go up this one. Okay. Really? Well, I thought there was like a pit down there or something that you can fall into. Okay, that's done. Okay, it's good. 
and that's yeah this is like a shortcut big bad boss bass four bees <coughs> Okay. We, oh, there's um sharks and this weird water stuff. Yeah. Okay, it's come hope. Okay. I'm having to be extremely careful on what to do here. Mm. Yeah, sadly he's like a one hit kill, so I'm having to be extremely careful on what I do here. Okay, what's this do? It don't do anything. Is that like a, a single hit thing? Alright, I think these platforms are the ones that we actually got to use. There. I think he's got a really bad hitbox on him, that's why, because like, he didn't die in the water. And that just leads to the castle, but we won't be doing that yet. Okay, we are in a new area at the minute, so let's actually study this a little bit. So let's come over here, let's float down, there we are. Okay. That's good. Good level. And now let's do this. There was more levels in the fort. Swamp Romp. And we got um, these fog guys, which really let's just go over because I don't want to deal with them. Oh, look at that. Okay, so um, yeah, you can kill these in like one hit because they're like the um, Goombas. But they stay on the screen for a little bit. Is this death? No, it's not. Oh, it's just really thick slug. Okay. Shut up. You can't even kill him. Wow, these are getting rather annoying. They're bouncing. Okay. Every time you kill one, there's always like another one a, f a few seconds later. Oh, that's better. Yeah, them frogs with their springy stuff. Okay, how's this? Uh, arachnid an antics. Oh, well, we've got the um, spiders with their little things with them. Okay, so yeah, we got the um, arachnid spiders which you can just kill by stepping on them. Okay. Wow. Okay, so um, a multi-purpose it looks like. Oh, what? Right. So oh, all right. They're not flimps or fomps or anything. God, these spiders look weird. Okay. Get that. Get these. And now we just continue on. Okay. 
really now. Can I kill this one? Yes, I can. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's quickly swoop over here. There we go. <laughs> that was a fun level. Quite like that. The, the um, spiders disguised as fomps and fimps, but not anyway. Temple trouble. Okay, so it looks like no, they're not fire. I love how how the um, maker G Gamma V is incorporating um, Sid Mayo Land enemies into it. So that's actually a real nice touch. I very much like that. It gives the feel of what a Super Mario game, Super Mario Land game, would be like if it if it would be like another one. But from what I understand is um, there is already a um, Super Mario Land 3, but it's called Wario Land for some reason. It's like Super Mario Land 3 Wario Land. It's full of likely. Game Boy. Oh, I didn't see that. But yeah, they, they call it Super Mario Land 3, but they have Wario as the main character in it. So it's like, okay, that'd be weird. And you might as well know I do not like Wario games. Like Wario Rare, that's just pretty good, little fun mini games. And it doesn't really have much of a story to it, so I can deal with it. But um, the main games of his I do not like. Okay, that's easy. Little temple, I quite enjoyed that little level. Okay, next level is they might be giants. There might be giants, okay. Oh, boy, here we go. Oh, wow. Weird giant things I love big big lands like this really good <laughs> well this is a really good um, level quite like that okay it's a bit of lag going on but not very much okay Up here, snip up here, get that. Shake, shake. <laughs> I, lo I love the shaking effect they in included when they, um, when they, um, done the hitting the block animation. That's actually a nice touch there. There we are, he just jumped in the air, so let's just go forth and onwards. That was a really short level. <coughs> let's do another level, shall we? Um, I'm just going to call it Pranasima's Castle. Hang on. Looks like we're going to go up against a. Um, Big bass, and we got these little blower guys here, so they're quite nice. Okay, we've got a combination of um, oh, we can climb up these. Yeah, we've got a combination of big enemies, Super Mario World land enemies, and um, other sort of stuff here. I didn't see them through the flames. Okay, so let's go. Okay, let's just go down here. Right. Luckily, we got the cape, so I'm just like flutter over everything, so that's quite nice. And I'm not going to take that. We're going this great big pipe. And into this great big. Um, basement area. Ah! Oh, we can 
claw on the top of that. Alright. Oh, the hitbox. Come on, don't do this to me, hitbox. Look, they're not even in the pipes. They just pasted the pipe over it. As if it were spikes. Oh well, doesn't really matter though. That's a tiny bit better. Ooh, this, this is a rather dangerous level. And then prime the... Oh wait, it's boss. Okay. This boss... Um, Oh right, here we go. There we are. <laughs> Oh. I might as well go speed that bit up because that was real long winded. Okay. What? Hmm. Hmm. I don't know what's going on. I don't think this is a broken hack because Gamma V likes to either complete stuff or make demos. So I'm going to put this down as a demo. Um, let me just check just once. Okay guys, this is the Impay. I know you can't see much, but um, Gamma V states that this is a demo and it covers the first three builds of the hack. So there you go. So yeah, uh, we're done with the um, we're done with the um, hack. So it's three builds. is is really good in my opinion. There was some things that actually needed to um, get right, but it, it is a demo, and I'm hoping to play the um, full hack once it's out. So yeah, um, next time, hopefully tomorrow, I would have my reactive box in for November, so I can do an unboxing on that, and um, maybe a new hack soon after. So who knows? Anyway, I've been Luke Paul Smith and I will see you next time soon, Turner.